Hi everyone, this is Deborah from Hello My Garden and I am standing here in the aftermath of Hurricane Matthew, which only gave us about, I should say only gave us about five inches, but having not had a whole lot of rain this summer, it was kind of a mixed blessing. We really needed the water, but five inches was, well, it's made the place a little soggy. Now, we're blessed because so close to us has had some pretty bad flooding conditions. We actually got a call this morning that our water plant in the city limits or the water that we use, which is city water, something happened to the plant and we've been, uh, we're on a water shortage now. So we're only supposed to use water for drinking and cooking and nothing else. Um, and I'm, and no word on how long that's going to be or what the problem is. So, but this is our fairy pumpkin, I guess. I have no idea what this monster squash is. We first had it last year and my belief is that it's from the seeds of a, of a pumpkin that I got at a farmer's market the year before that and it was called pumpkin, I mean it was called fairy pumpkin and it was just such a pretty pumpkin I bought it and I saved some of the seeds and I didn't, I guess I planted one last year but it pretty much took over the garden and this year the one that you're looking at just popped up and it popped up in pots in various places and in the beds I guess from dirt we've reused maybe but in any case I moved it because it was in the in the raised beds and you could tell here that it has taken over the yard and so I want to show you one of the pumpkins right here not quite mature but they're really pretty and we've got them everywhere and I don't know being now that it's October whether they're gonna make it um, to maturity or not we usually eat them as young squash oh uh, here's one just a little bit younger than this one I don't know if it's too dark for you to see right there um, but when they become pumpkins it's just a beautiful beautiful pumpkin with very dark orange flesh uh, but it's a very resilient pumpkin and uh, resilient against the pest and the bugs that is so hopefully these will make it to maturity and I'm actually going to plan on donating some of these maybe to the food share program I spoke about in my last video because there'll be a lot more than I'll be able to will be able to consume and we're a little bit tired of the squash right now there's a young one there's a young squash right there can you see it it's can I see it right there that's about the size we normally eat that little pumpkin that little squash right there um, we normally eat them as squash. Now once they get a little bit bigger than that, we just leave them to mature. And uh, so I got a, we've got a whole lot of these pumpkins here. There's another one right there, right there, and another one right there. Let's see, they're everywhere. See, they just kind of crawl over everything. They just grow over everything. Here's another one hanging right there so if anyone knows anything about this fairy squash I don't know even if it's hybridized there's another one right there you want to talk to me about it give me a comment um, but it's a resilient wonderful pumpkin okay. and I hope you all have a is there more no so I thought I saw a little bit more orange mature one, but I guess not. There's more of them right here. All right, there's one. There's one. Two more down there. So it is the yard eating pumpkin right there. So, anyway, this is going to be a different video. I think I'm going to be able to upload this right into YouTube. Uh, due to an update to my YouTube. I'm not sure. I wasn't able to do that before. It would save me a little bit of trouble, I'll have to say, because our computer, our home computer, automatically updated to Windows 10. And I don't want to make this a review or anything. 
but I don't care for Windows 10 and it's made finding anything on our computer extremely hard. Um, so, anyway, hope you all have a great gardening week and I hope Hurricane Matthew has not harmed any of you in any way. Uh, thank you all for watching.